A while back, we showed you how you could make some really cool concrete skulls with nothing more than a plastic mold from the Dollar Tree. Today, I'm going to show you a simple way to paint them and get a cool effect at the same time. As you can see here, I started by painting the concrete skull in a flat black. For this skull, I'm going to start with a basic dark blue over top of the black. You'll want to cover it as much as possible, but don't worry about getting into every crack and crevice, and certainly don't get into the sockets of the eyes. After the first coat dries, I come back with a slightly lighter shade of blue, again covering the entire skull, but avoiding those cracks and crevices. After that dries, I come back with a lavender blue. And as you can start to see, we're building up quite a few layers. And each time, I'm using the paint just sparingly enough to cover the skull, but not get into any of the details. Once the lavender blue dries, I come back with a baby blue. And by now, you get the idea. With the baby blue dry, it's time to create some mid-layer shadows. So this time, I'm going to use a light purple. To set that mid-layer shadow effect, we're going to come back with the baby blue one more time. Lastly, we'll come back with just a dusting of plain white. This is strictly for highlight and really shouldn't affect the color of the skull at all. This will create a beautiful effect. And that's it. Eight quick layers of paint, and we're done. Let's take this thing outside into some natural light to see what it looks like. When you layer paint like this, you can actually start with any color you want. As you can see today, I started with black and then worked through the different shades of blue. I've also used red, green, brown, and a variety of other colors to the same effect. If you decide to make some concrete skulls yourself based on our other video, I hope this video gave you some ideas of how you can easily paint them. And if it did, well, you know I'd appreciate that thumbs up like. And maybe, just maybe, I'll see you on the next video. If you enjoy videos about the randomness of our amazing world, consider clicking on the globe to subscribe or maybe checking out one of the other videos right here.